They are about to make a lot of dingo wings go limp with this one. <laughs> this channel is about What the dealio, folkios? I am Ty Smith, Modern Renaissance Man, and welcome to my channel, Modern Renaissance Man. If you have been watching my channel for the past month or so, and you're still getting an idea about the channel, you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and keep on checking the channel out and subscribe after you actually like this. If you're someone that has been following my channel for a while, double check to make sure that you are still subscribed to the channel because people have been getting unsubscribed from my channel. They've been getting unsubbed from the channel. So double check to make sure that you still are subbed to me. All right. And also, if you like the material that I'm pushing out there, uh, get a video a like. This allows the video to get circulated within the YouTube algorithm to push videos like this and similar to it out there. So appreciate that. Double check also to make sure that you have gave five different people in your phone this channel's share. OK, I know I'm getting used to all this. I know y'all like, dude, you got to practice on that. I don't do anything script or anything like this. So I just fly off the whim. So, yeah, make sure that there's five people in your contact list who you have not sent this link to yet let them know about this channel so voices like mine and people that think like we do get out there okay so let's go ahead and get into this right here transgender athletes banned from women's sports in louisiana that's what the heck i'm talking about as it should be this says the fairness in women's sports act which bans transgender women from participating in women's sports will now become law in louisiana louisiana governor john bell edwards john bell edwards Hats off to you. Freaking be a governor. Do righteous things. Truthful things. It says that he took no action on the Republican-led bill by the end of legislative session, allowing the bill to become law. Whether it's intended or not, the effect is to send a strong message to at least some of these young people that they shouldn't be who they think they are, who they believe they are, who they know they are. Edward said in a press conference on Monday, I find that very distressing. I do believe that we can be better than that. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Time out. Louisiana Governor John Bell. Did I pre-clap this dude when I wasn't supposed to? Louisiana Governor John Bell Edwards took no action on the Republican-led bill by the end of the legislative session allowing the bill to become law. Said whether it's intended or not, the effect is to send a strong message to at least some of these young people that they shouldn't be who they think they are or who they believe they are, who they know they are. Edward said in the late press conference on Monday, I find that very distressing. I do believe that we can do better than that. Ah, I'm taking you. I'm taking these, man. Get these claps back. Hold on. He's saying the opposite. Hold on. He is actually mad about it. The legislation points to the biological differences between men and women. It claims strength, speed, endurance are generally found in greater degrees in biological males than biological females. That's a fact. Nature does not lie. Plain and simple. Nature does not lie. You can argue this to the day that you die. Nature is not going to lie. Plain and simple. Okay. It says the law also claims that hormone therapy after puberty is not effective until over a year after treatment begins but does not reference puberty blockers, which some trans youth take to temporarily halt puberty. They temporarily halt puberty. It says there is no conclusive evidence as to whether transgender women have an unfair advantage, some experts say. Look at the physical evidence. What the heck? A man got, the man trans and got into ultimate fighting, beating the stink out of women. Gosh, the, the Olympic lifter, the track athletes, Leah Thomas? <laughs> what the heck are you talking about here? Did I miss some? Get the heck. Look at the videos of the Army people. Look at the videos of the people in the dang on Navy SEALs fighting against these women. Oh, stop, stop, stop. A recent study found that hormone therapy is most effective at quailing physical advantages for two years, but the study had several limitations. For example, it didn't take into account differences in exercise habits. Several major athletic organizations, including the NCAA and the Olympics and the governing bodies of the U.S. National Sports Leagues, allowing transgender women to compete against cisgender women. 
LGBTQ advocates say such bans are aiming to solve a problem that does not exist. Right, because they're, that, that, that problem don't exist. Men are definitely not stronger, bigger, faster than women. Okay, I'm telling you what, Dan. What, when's the next Olympics? Because I might get into this. I might get into, I might trans and just call myself a woman and get into some Olympic sports so I can just get in there and just win. Maybe I should go and do shot putt and beat all the women there. Maybe I should do discus and beat all the women there. Now, long distance, they probably can get me. I'm not a distance runner. I don't care who. I might, I might get into women's. Dude, I can get into women's long jump right now. I can get into women's triple jump right now and win no woman is jumping past 52 53 feet i can jump that right now no women are jumping that far i can get in there and win the olympics i can win long jump i can win high jump easily still now i still can jump six eight six nine seven one i can beat these women right now i might man gosh oof, please give me some puberty blockers all you want to before the olympics come to me i'm my testosterone is already where it's supposed to be them things are not going to do it. Not puberty blockers, but, you know, the hormone therapy. That's not going to do anything. Doctors prove that because there's something that's in you called your balls your, where, that make that, where the testosterone flows from, whatever. And there's not going to be nothing you're going to do to be able to try to combat that. Not that natural, Hur! and man, get the heck out of here. Yeah, call it a toxic all you want to know. Just be mad that this is just a man and you're mad because we're bigger, faster, stronger, thicker, more bone density, more power than you. And now you want to call it toxic. No, except the fact that we better. Plain and simple. Oh, you're better than women. That ain't what I'm saying. I'm talking about on the physical level. Now, don't go there. I already told you that women are going to be just as smart as being doctors, lawyers, teachers, the whole nine. But when it comes to the physicality, y'all, it's no contest. Stop. Just stop. Man. SB44 is a direct attack on transgender youth that are trying their best just to be kids and fit in and play alongside their peers. The human right campaign said in a statement when legislation first passed, when it first, when legislation first passed the legislator, it continued trans kids, like all kids across the country have said themselves, they play sports for the same reasons all kids do to be a part of a team, to learn discipline and above all have fun with their friends. Well then stay in the men's league then be a trans woman, but stay playing in the men's sport, right? Be a trans woman and still play in the men's sport. Anyway, there have been more than 300 bills targeting LGBTQ community. They ain't targeting you. It's targeting. It's not targeting anybody. This what I'm saying. See what I'm saying? Listen to the wording on this. Don't try to say that these bills are targeting LGBTQ. Y'all, you guys are making yourselves a target. I'm serious. Y'all, y'all. I don't care. Y'all can get mad at me all you want to. You can come for me all you want to. I do not care. I will sit there and debate any of y'all. I will blast y'all and throw the stuff right back in your face because you have done this to your dang on self. Most a lot of animals out in the wild, they got these things where they can do camouflage. They actually got their natural skin or fur texture that they blend in with their surroundings. Why? Because they're not trying to be seen. You guys put yourselves out there. I mean, for real. I mean, we knew that there was people that were gay, trans, and all that. This stuff is not, it's nothing new. This stuff was going on since ancient times. The only difference is you guys are making yourselves being seen. You're making yourself the target. You guys are the ones going around. We not you making people pay attention, y'all. Whoever really need pay y'all no attention. Y'all claim that everybody hates y'all. That y'all getting all this hate. You are causing it because you're trying to force stuff on people that nobody cared about. So right now, when you say there have been 300 bills targeting the LGBTQ communities, no. If you weren't going around being all flamboyant and crazy, y'all so tolerant that y'all are intolerant of everybody else. If you weren't going around doing all those things like that, no one would be paying y'all no attention. I think that's what made y'all pissed off is that nobody paid y'all no attention. So you just like a child. I'm not saying all of you. So don't go there. I'm not saying all of you. I'm talking about the ones that are crazy, extreme, radical about it. You're like a child that nobody pays attention to. So you're doing everything you can to get the attention. One of my children did that before. He felt that he was not getting attention. So he would act out just so I can pay him attention. He would take something, throw it, boom. Now why did you, all because he wanted my attention. That's what a lot of them are doing. You are acting out and doing all kind of outrageous, flamboyant things. So somebody can pay y'all some attention. So now you need to go down there and get on this thing on a deeper psychological level of what's going on. Why, why, if my son is doing that, why is he trying to get my attention? What is it that I'm missing that my son is trying to get my attention on? Oh, am I paying attention to something else over there? Does my child feel like I don't care about him? Does my child feel like I'm not giving him that quality time? Does he feel like I'm not doing something for him, for him to have to act out to get my attention? So amongst the LGBTQ community, if you guys are all for each other and all surrounded with love and all stuff like that, why are you doing everything else trying to get the world's attention? Why? You are all part of your own community. Nobody cares. Y'all got a y'all got a freaking month. This month right now in June, y'all got a pride month and all that. 
Then you sat there and did something abominable by making a rainbow, which God made a covenant saying he'll never flood the world again. You made that your flag and all that, right? And so, I mean, I don't, that's what I'm saying. I don't get it. Why are you trying to have all this attention? Why? Don't get me wrong. It goes on, but it goes both ways too. Black people are doing it too. Black Lives Matter, NAACP, they all are doing this thing where they're drawing so much attention to them because they want, what? why? It's a psychological thing that goes on. Why are you trying to draw all this attention to you? Why are you lashing out doing so much radicalized things to draw the attention to you? Because we're tired. Who's doing something to y'all? And if it is, where's the report set on this? Anyway, that's how I went off, to, folks. Anyway, folks, um, plain and simple, what do y'all think about it on this? To me, I think Louisiana is awesome for doing this. No biological men need to be in no biological women's sports. If there's going to be trans women, if these men are claiming to be trans women, then have a trans women league. They're not going to do it. You want to know why? It's going to be still men's sports. Boy, some people are crazy, boy, just crazy. I'm, I'm not saying that. I'm not saying it to be condescending. I'm literally saying that legit crazy, like mentally crazy for real. Oh boy, Ty, you're going to get in trouble. No, I'm dead serious. Oh, so no, it, it don't matter now because, oh, because the whole world and doctors and all these people like that who don't care about anything but your money is supporting you and egging you on and encouraging you in your mental illness that you have, but it's okay. Ty, my son, I'm not calling people that, look, stop, just stop. Don't try to go there with me. We're not talking about people that are gay. See what I'm saying? You're just trying to throw yourself in the mix when you do things like that. My child is gay, so what you saying? He got mental illness? If you want me to talk to you on a one-on-one level, I would do that. I'm not about to answer that. No, I answer yes. But anyway, what I'm saying is that when it comes to this particular subject we're talking about right now, when it's when we're talking about biological men want to play women's sports, yes, I would say you're crazy for trying to do that to claim that you are not a biological, you're a biological man. You can claim to be a woman all you want to. No more do you can claim to be a giraffe, a rabbit, a raccoon, whatever you want to be. But when it all comes down to it, nature does not lie. That body of yours is natural. That's nature. Nature does not lie. You're bigger, faster, stronger than the league that you're playing in right now, unless you're trying to downplay it. Leah Thomas made a powerful statement, said, I lost so much muscle mass, I lost so much strength, but yet still blew the women out of the water. Come on, man. Y'all get out of here with this nonsense. Anyway, I know I said some stuff to tick some of y'all off because y'all think that I'm trying to come at y'all homosexual daughters or homosexual sons in some kind of way, but I'm not. You need to really listen to what I'm saying. You seeing more of my passion and more of the words that I'm saying and the tone and all that, and all of a sudden you getting offended and ready to respond. I don't think that you... Listen, but pay, go back, pause the video, go back and listen to what I actually am saying. That's what you need to do. Listen to what I actually am saying. Yes, you are crazy if you think that nature lies. You are crazy if you think that these men who trans to women and get into women's sports, those individuals who say, no, I don't think I have an unfair advantage. Stop, crazy, stop doing that. But because everybody want to cater to their mental illness that they got going on, their, their, their gender dysphoria that they got going on, all of a sudden, I'm going to be the one being the one being rude and mean and insensitive and all. You can call it what you want to, but I'm not going to lie. It's the truth, plain and simple. Truth knows no color. Truth don't care about your feelings. Like Ben said, facts don't care about your feelings. I'm sorry, uh, facts don't care about your feelings. I'm just saying they don't. And not that I don't care about you as an individual, but I don't care that you get upset at me because I'm telling you the truth. Plain and simple. Anyway, let me know what y'all think of this, folks. I know we on a roll. Uh, I'm getting ready to get out of here. Don't forget, double check to make sure that you are still subscribed to the channel. If you like what I'm doing thus far, click the subscribe button. Go ahead and do it. Join. Don't forget to hit the bell notification too. Hit it to all to where anytime I do anything, it's going to alert you and let you know that I'm live, all right? Or that I posted a video. I am Ty Smith, Modern Renaissance Man, and hoping and praying that every last one of you have food, shelter, and clothing, and most of all, I hope and pray every last one of you guys are in great health. God bless you all through Jesus. What's going on, everybody? So, hey, check this out. I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate you taking time out of your day to view these videos. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel, give the video a thumbs up, and also, right here, is where you can catch the next video, the latest video that I've done. But like right up here, this is stuff that I've done kind of in the past. So in this area, you might find a video that I've done in the past. It can be funny. It can be something serious. It does not matter. But this is something that you can also do to check out more material that I do in my channel. Because I do a lot in this channel, all right? So again, appreciate everything from you guys. Keep on watching it. Keep on supporting it. And God bless you all.